faculty tips stating that they increase the risk of thermal burns, increase wound healing time, and increase the risk of infection. Our faculty tip will alleviate and minimize these problems by allowing the surgeon to decrease the procedural time and by decreasing the dissipation energy. Manufacturing, or at least prototyping something that's going to be able to be prototyped. It would be great if you could prototype something that's compatible with a uh, hand piece setting mm -hmm. and be able to test it. That would be really cool. So what we have here in gold is an unmodified FACO emulsification tip. This type of tip is named a Kelman tip and has a 30 degree bevel. So upon analysis of this tip efficiency, we designed a prototype which can be seen up here on this SOLIDWORKS image that sharpens the outer edges into the inner edge. That is, tapers the outer edges into the inner edge. So the idea behind doing such a design is that the FACO emulsification tip will have an easier time penetrating the cataract and therefore cutting through it. So as you can see in the image of our prototype, we have a bevel angle of about 30 degrees and also tapered outer walls into the inner walls. So the idea behind the bevel is that there is a sharper leading cutting edge go coming into the cataract, making it much easier to sculpt or to remove material. The other benefit of having a bevel angle is that it increases the area that is contacting the cataract, therefore producing a higher suction force on the cataract. Therefore, with using this design, we are able to obtain a greater cutting efficiency as well as a greater sucking force.
site. So then basically what I've done is I did the first part, which is sculpting, which basically cuts the lens into two pieces. Then in that part, you know, you probably shouldn't use for your kind of evaluation because that's just basically separating it. But this last part that I've just completed is basically remove the entire lens on the, um, the left-hand side. So now let's go ahead and go to your other tip. Now the other thing you should look at is in terms of ultrasound energy, now what we should, the only thing about this is this includes everything including the sculpting. So I guess on the next ones you should probably keep track of it after you do the sculpting. Okay. That keep, and actually what we can do is we can, we can reset the, the energy so that, you know, just do it for each eye. Okay. Okay. And so maybe for the next eye we can start with a, uh, the the new tip for sculpting, so you can actually get an idea how if they make any difference for you sculpting part okay. of the surgery. So that's the reference tip. Where's the material? Seemed like it bounced a little more. More. Okay. And that yeah. we had anticipated because they've lost a little bit of the surface area at the front of the tip. Oh, I see. So the cross section. Um, so going back to this one. Going back to this one, and we'll yep, and we'll go to uh, the next slide. So right. Oh no, no, no. Yeah, no. we'll keep it. So keep we're going to do a second eye, the yeah. same exact yeah. thing. Okay. In order to manufacture and introduce our tips to the market. The tips must be made from titanium 6AI 4B material and must meet the International Organization for Standardization document 10993. Regulations under the document are include but not are not limited to evaluation and testing in the risk management process, selection of tests for interaction with blood, selection of reference materials, tests for irritation and delayed type of hypersensitivity, and tests for systemic toxicity. Throughout the course of this project, I've learned the importance of applying mechanical concepts and theories to some, making something as little as a pickle multiplication test. Over the course of the senior design project, I learned about the power of teamwork and doing things before the deadline. The most important thing that I learned from our senior design project is that teamwork and coordination is perhaps the, the crucial for the successfulness of any project. Through the senior design project, I've been able to work with an engineer as well as other staff at AMO. I would not have been able to have this experience if I had not been in this project wow. as an undergrad at UCI. From this senior project, I feel like it's very important to have students from different backgrounds so that we can learn knowledge from each other. Through senior design, I've learned the importance of teamwork, cooperation, everyone working together towards one goal, as well as designing and prototyping and improving on previous designs and changing various things to make our design better. So you take the tip and we place it in our eye that's how we do cataract surgery. Find the cutting of the lens and also the denaturization. Right now? I'm just trying to boost her great. I'm telling you. I'm serious. Uh, was that on the camera? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Are we just filming this? From this senior project, it's. For me, senior project, I learned it. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I have to stop and again. Oh, you've been recording this whole time? Yeah. Okay. Throughout the senior design, 